Robot simply means, in its bare minimum, interfacing between the surgeon and the patient a device. And that device might be a large machine. Uh, it might be a small object like this. The, so the robot never does the surgery on its own, and my robot never makes rounds on its own. I've never come in in the morning and heard that, oh, I heard you made rounds, and I actually didn't. The robot came to life. These are simply machines that we place between us and the patient to aid us. The robot that we're talking about today enables me to see a patient, to visualize what they look like without actually being there. It's called a double robotic. I guess you could call it an iPad on a stick with wheels and it enables us to wheel up to our patients and get up close and look at them and they can see me and I can certainly get a look at them and the numbers up on the monitors and all and uh, brings me a little closer when I'm farther away. I tend to look in on my patients the first post-operative night. Our patients after a long day of surgery will very frequently come off the breathing machine and be fully awake early in the evening. The idea or concept of what we call telemedicine has been around for a couple decades but not really used extensively until the past five or ten years. With my iPhone I can pull up the uh, robot activated from anywhere. The big advantage I have with that is the ability to connect to them whenever I want. I used it initially to try it out and see how it worked. And now I use it frequently, almost every night, for a patient who's a fresh post-operative patient who has just come out of the operating room. It gives me a little bit of peace of mind. We have uh, spooked a few people. Unfortunately, as we come down the hallway, it's a, it's a very silent device. And if someone is not aware of it or not looking up, suddenly uh, an iPad appears in front of their face. I've had quite a few oohs. It takes a little getting used to for the staff, but the patients don't seem to be uh, surprised that much. They'll take a look and they recognize my face and uh, again, usually burst into a big smile.